Even though Christmas is now over and we are all looking forward to a whole new year, the Pikeville Main Street program wants to invite those who haven't had enough of Christmas to participate in their Christmas scavenger hunt. The scavenger hunt is happening in downtown Pikeville. We want people to, you know, take this time, maybe their families are in or they're just looking for something fun to do. They can walk around town and find all kinds of items in the scavenger hunt. All of the items that you're looking for are very visible. They're either in the windows or hanging over your head. <laughs> the idea to hold the scavenger hunt came from an elementary school teacher in which Minta thinks is a great idea to get out and have fun with the family. But some of the items on the list can be a little tricky to find. And we ask you to name, I think there's four on there, to say where you see these at, because we want to know that you've really been out looking. But you start here on Main Street in front of the Appalachian Wireless Arena. We have a little red old newspaper box here that we have the scavenger hunt papers in there, and there's some ink pens. So you don't need to do anything except come, open the red box, and just walk around town. Not only is the scavenger hunt a fun outdoor activity, but you will also receive a reward for completing it. You can take your finished list into either Faith Life Market for a hot chocolate or a hot drink, or to Heroes, which is located on 2nd Street, and you can get an ice cream or a drink there. So the scavenger hunt has just all kinds of Christmas items, but it just lets you look at the lights downtown and have, you know, just a walk around town with your family. For those who plan on participating, January 1st, 2021 is the last day to scavenge, and Minta says to keep your eyes peeled as this isn't the last socially distanced game they have planned. We will look for this to continue all, all year long with different types of scavenger hunts. Look for another scavenger hunt to come soon. Reporting from Pikeville, Kentucky, I'm Jeremy Justice with Mountaintop News.